What is up everyone, it's Grey Falcon here with another video and today I will be showing you one of the best tweaks for iOS and that is also free. So, as you can see here I have a quick switcher, I am using it right now and it's really really cool and also 3 has been updated for iOS 9 that is why I am so happy. So let's jump into the settings so you can see what this tweak is all about. So as you can see here we have a multi center which basically merges the multitask and the control center. So if I swipe down from the bottom middle you get the multitasker and you get the control center as a standalone card and how you would use it basically by just tapping on it and by using the sliders you can tap and hold and then move it. The next thing here is the quick switcher. So if you pull up from the bottom left you can quick switch to any apps you have open which is a really really cool thing and you have hot corners so if you swipe up from the bottom left it closes the app you are currently in so you can see that it has some cool animation as well where the home screen card just zooms out and in which is really really cool let's go on to the advanced options and as you can see here we have access app switch and if you toggle this on and swipe from the bottom left and let go we get the app switcher and we have invert hot corners and if we toggle that on what it does is inverts the quick switcher and the close app so if I swipe from the bottom left you can see that it switches it to the close and if I swipe from the bottom right it gives me the quick switcher and we have open multi center to the current app or we have lost app and the control center we have confirmed close all apps so we have that told on if I were to swipe on the home screen card we get this little X right there so it doesn't close all apps without my confirmation and we have exclude currently playing which excludes if you have music playing it won't close that app and you can exclude apps that you don't want to close also have disable in apps where basically also won't work in those specific apps and disable double click home which basically disables any action triggered by pressing the home button so if I were to toggle this on and press the home button twice I won't get the multitask switcher so that was it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did hit that like button if you want to see more videos like this then go ahead and subscribe see you guys in the next one peace